Hello, Brian here from Nelson Creek Outdoors. Been quite a while since I've done any videos. You know, I have to admit, once YouTube took away my monetization, I I stopped doing a lot of videos, and there were some other reasons too. But uh, this year, I'm gonna try and get back to it again. So I thought I'd just uh, talk to you about uh, what I plan on doing and for this year, and and take a little ride since I'm going stir crazy. Uh, I do go to work a couple times a week, and on the way home here, I pass one of my fishing lakes here, so I thought I'd stop and take a look. Doc's not in yet, but uh, boy, I'd really like to be out there fishing. <laughs> but anyways, back to the what I plan on doing this year. I did buy another camera, not the one I'm using now. This is the the one that uh, the Kodak camera that I've had for a long time, uh, little compact video camera shoots a decent video so and has pretty decent audio so I, I like it and I, I've used it in the boat a lot for pictures and for uh, videos but I thought I misplaced it I sold my my old f-150 and I thought I left it in there uh, about two years ago and well heck maybe longer than that and then uh, where did I find it yeah right on the shelf where I normally keep it isn't that how that works see some geese up there might be able to hear them in my audio I'm not sure uh, but uh, I did buy a, a GoPro style camera, a cheaper one, Chinese one, Cam Park camera. It does do 4K video and stuff, and it does pretty good. Um, I bought it specifically for the boat and waiting for the mount I ordered for the boat. But I'm going to put it in the console in the boat facing toward the fishing chair in the front and uh, hope to do more fishing videos this year. And then. Uh, Hopefully this weekend I can sneak out to my place and stick in some trail cams. I do have a new cellular cam, solar cellular cam, uh, and then a couple just regular solar uh, trail cams, um, spy points, uh, that I want to get out in the woods. So I'll have three, four cameras out this year on my property uh, up north, my deer hunting property. But uh, I was looking for deer, pheasants, turkeys, whatever I could see here over the last couple of days. Ain't seen a one. Um, here in Wisconsin, the, uh, despite what the DNR says, I, I don't believe there's anywhere near the number of deer they say there are, because some of these areas that used to be just stuffed full of deer, um, I just don't see them anymore. And I do realize uh, there, are, there are populations of deer around, I just think they're very pocketed. You know, my hunting property has a lot of deer on it, yet uh, I, can, I shoot deer every year, multiple deer every year, and pass on a lot more. But uh, I do think a lot of areas just don't have the populations they used to have. I think it's getting to be undeniable at this point. Anyway, that's I do plan on doing more videos, more hunting, more fishing. Um, don't know if I'm going to go out turkey hunting yet or not. Uh, my property's not very good for turkeys. There's a few there, but in the spring it's usually so wet they don't like to be on my property. Uh, of course, the last time I did go turkey hunting there, I decided to go in the neighbor's, got permission to go in the neighbor's place. and hunted over there and then pulled the camera pictures and right where I would have normally hunted turkeys or great big Tom was on camera strutting around so you never know anyway that's it I do plan on doing more stuff so uh, maybe uh, like you know give us a you know follow this page here our, our YouTube channel and and uh, you know what is that uh, like or follow or whatever but it's been so long I don't even remember the terminology <laughs> but again Brian with Nelson Creek Outdoors I look forward to doing more videos in the future See you soon.